Hello everybody, my name is Shadi Sin and welcome back to the channel. Today, actually for the next few days, we're gonna be in the Cayman Islands because I'm here for my girl May May's bachelorette, but technically it's May May and Jacobs. The guys are on one side of the house, the girls are on one side of the house. Oh my God, I wasn't gonna vlog this experience because I was like, let me just say in the moment, it's stunning, it's gorgeous. I love May May. May May deserves the world. Like when I say she's the most genuine person, like most deserving person I've ever met of like such goodness in her life, I want to give her the best time she's ever experienced. But I got here, I was the first one here, which I was like, how the heck did I book this last minute? But I'm the first one here. Now everybody's here, we're decorating the place. I changed my outfit. I have a black bow bikini on. It's so cute. It's a top like this and you can tie it around the neck like this. But I just have it down because I hate weird tan lines. And then this is actually a linen set that is from Sisterly Swimwear. But I, instead of wearing the top, I just bought the pants and I'm so happy about it because I do want to cover up my tattoo because it's kind of new and I have like, it's peeling. This necklace, I wanted this so bad because so many girls were wearing it. I'm so excited for you guys to see what's in store. I don't know a lot of people here who are here. Maybe and Jacob are the people who I know. And then like, it's Jacob's family, Mamie's family, Mamie's cousins. And I'm like, this is like a real bachelorette experience. Like you get to meet people, you get to see their vibes, like, you talk, you conversate. And I'm like, this is so crazy because it could be like, ha ha, rah, rah. And the next time we all going to see each other, it's going to be at, like one of their peaceful like um, marriage like ceremonies. I'm just going to unpack my like hand luggage and my suitcase over there. I just want to throw some things in the closet because I know I'm just an unpacker and then I'll go downstairs. So a lot of brands gifted and made me a bunch of stuff and it's so nice so we just set them up. Put some stuff in there. We got some Too Faced, Grande Cosmetics, Steve Madden sent some shoes over. This is so crazy. I've seen brands do this but I've never had to do it for somebody and I'm like wow this is hard work. I think each um, person I'm going to end up doing differently because it's cool. I can literally decorate each person's like set up differently. And these are their set of pajamas. I'm gonna go to the next room now. Just finished setting up May May's room. Look at that. Like in my head, I'm like, I don't want to overcrowd the bed, but I'm like, we have such amazing things. And like these. So excited for. Oh, this is so cute. A little bride. Hello and get ready with me in the Cayman Islands. Literally, my view. I will flip it at one point. Look at these eye patches. I have arrived at Cayman Islands. This place, you don't even see it on the map. You have to zoom in extra, extra, extra large. And it's like, I get it. Like, I want to, like, gatekeep. This place is incredible. It's like Jamaica plus Turkey Caicos plus, like, Hispanic countries plus Hawaii plus, like, oh, my God. This place is, like, the perfect mixing pot. This is what America should be. But whatever. I digress. We're here for Mamie's Bachelorette. We came, I put on a bikini, I hadn't showered here, I brushed my teeth. We were just chilling, hitting it out, decorated. I love girls. Girls, they just do what girls need. We just decorated, just take pictures. Love us. Took a shower. I feel like I'm 10 pounds lighter because all of the dirt that I accumulated on my body because it's so humid and hot here has come off. I brushed my teeth. I'm gonna do makeup. It's gonna, I'm gonna sweat it off, but I wanna look a little glowy. I wanna look like a little alive. As in, all I really care for, oh, look at the sun coming through. Um, it's a little glow. So the, the dinner theme, obviously it's May May. Itinerary is ready. Themes for every night. Tonight's is tequila sunset, sunrise. It's, I guess it's sunset. So people are going to wear pinks, orange, red. I have an orange dress and a a yellow dress, like a gold dress. I think I'm learn, leaning towards the gold. Let me show you. Okay, so these are the two dresses I have. This one, obviously gold. TJ or Marshalls. I got this at Marshalls. It's cute, it's lovely, it's not body conny, and I feel like this is what I need right now. This one, this one is smexy, sexy, and I'm like, I don't know if I'm trying to give this right now. Like, it's, and then this whole side area is cut out. Look at this, from tit to ass, cut out. And I, I was like, I should wear it. Maybe I'll wear it later in this trip and I take a picture with it just because I brought it. But I think we're gonna lean towards the gold, talk about gold jewelry, and just like a, a sun kiss glow. Let's do the makeup. Okay, today, did this be? as quick as I possibly could. Wash my hair, put the thingy in it. I put so much like leg. This is slug thingy. Oh my God, future wise face slug. If you have dry skin, you should use this. But now I put this on my body because my tattoo was peeling stuff too. I feel like sticky, icky, icky. On a, like another time, I would totally wear this dress, heels, all that good stuff. All I did is one chunky bracelet, gold earrings. I can't be bothered. My hair is probably just gonna go into a half up, half down. This gold inner corner is really just taking over, honestly. Night one in Cayman Islands, baby. 
I'm so excited for every single day. Went out to the pool, had some fun. We had dinner, we made some tech talks, obviously. And now we changed into our pajamas because we're just gonna do a little chill, like a pajama night, have some ice cream. It's 8.46 and I think around like 10 o'clock, we're gonna go out to the club because one of the bartenders who came through, he was like, oh yeah, the club at Friday night is the best. So we're going to three clubs, we're starting at like 10.30, 11. It's like a 20 minute drive. And then boom, bar, club, another club, another club. And we'll see where the night takes us, but I'm gonna take you with me. Ish thingy. It was fun. It was cute. But we came back, ate some french fries, taking my clothes off, showering, editing pictures, posting, going to bed, hopefully before 3. Thank you. It's 3.37 in the morning. I just finished posting my stories. So many stories. It took me over an hour. Probably like an hour and a half, two hours. Just posted that. Posted like four TikToks. I was going to make a vlog and I have to. I'm not getting out of bed tomorrow until I make this vlog. So... I'm going to sleep, but good night for now. Good ass morning. Change into my pink bikini, literally from pink itself. I woke up so early, but then I was like, ah, nobody's gonna be up. So I went back to bed. And then I woke up at like 10 something, and everybody obviously is fully ready. But everybody's at the pool. They had breakfast, so I'm gonna go ahead and have breakfast. Let me go and draw myself. Got dressed for the glitz and glam night. It looks so cute. I love this. Yeah, kind of ish. I do want to buy jewelry. That's the goal today. Oh, yeah. If I buy some jewelry. Buy some here? Yeah, that, like, they're not for the. We're going to a jewelry store right now. Huh? It's like we're going to town. They're taking us to a jewelry store. We're going to drink champagne. If you don't, I do. Hello. <laughs> 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 so first we made a stop at Island Jewelers, one of the best jewelry stores in the Cayman Islands. We had a literal private shopping experience. We were greeted with champagne, met the most lovely people. And just a cherry on top, Island Jewelers was so kind and gave all of our friends some unbelievably generous discounts. Welcome back to the channel. <laughs> Is it recording? Yeah. <gasps> I really want to Heineken makes non-alcoholic beer. What the? It tastes just like beer. I feel like I'm not a real sober person now because of this. But it's so cute the way they have set up. Look. They set up here. We're doing a little like cocktail session. The guy playing this and then look over there. This is literally just like a private island. Okay, first off, welcome to our last day of The Bachelor and Bachelorette. Yeah! Da -da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Period. Yeah, baby. You rock that boat. Oh, guys. Peter Marcelli. So, 
where we are now, you can go out there, just shuffle your feet whilst you're in there and you will see the sea stars. You can hold them, but you can't take them out of the water, right? What is it actually like doing a joint bachelorette party with all 15 of your girls and all 15 of his guys in the Cayman Islands? This might have been the craziest experience of our life. So immediately when we landed, we headed to the Black Urchin, which literally had our jaws on the floor at every angle. Look how insanely gorgeous this property is. The Cayman Islands might be the most beautiful place we have ever stepped foot. And the fact that Jacob and I get to experience this together honestly makes it so special. So the first night we were greeted with so much love. We had a rum tasting plus welcome drinks hosted by Cayman Spirits. Then we had a local restaurant, Fresca, come cook a private Caymanian style dinner for us. This was the first time we ever had a private chef and getting to experience the local style food, it was scrumptious. Thank you so much to Fresca for the most beautiful dinner and giving us the nicest, warmest welcome to day one. Day two, we obviously had to enjoy this beautiful property. The boys ventured out into the ocean while the girls relaxed and eventually convinced us out to sea too. Kamana Bay actually invited us to enjoy the evening for a special dining and shopping experience. Guys, I really had no idea what to expect, but we were in shock. First, we visited Island Jewelers for a private shopping experience, and we were greeted with so much love and champagne. I don't know what was in the air, but everything was so eye-catching, and the warmth I felt in my heart when I saw the guys immediately shopping for their ladies at home. Green flag, guys guys green flag thank you so much to island jewelers for showing us so much kindness we really will not forget it and our night was not over kamana bay had a private dinner plan for us and guys this was our literal reaction because what in the world when they said private dinner i thought we were doing like a restaurant or something kamana bay had us dining on a literal private island they had a bar for our friends live music this gorgeous setup genuinely immaculate i cannot get over this and it was all for us plus the food the most delicious meal that we have ever eaten i am not just saying this i am still thinking about every single bite and our friends will not shut up about it thank you so much to aqua for the most delicious meal then day three was a boat day and we were on a yacht guys a yacht came in luxury charters took us out for the day and we had the best time in the sun they took us to stingray city and this was insane crazy bro we were swimming with literal stingrays and apparently if you kiss them you get seven years of good luck guys i turned around for one second and jacob literally learned how to charm the stingrays and was just hanging out with them